Well, hello there, you beautiful people. My name is Willow's Duality, and today we're going to be continuing our modded Fallout 4 playthrough on the survival difficulty. This is episode 8, or part 8, or something like that. And I just wanted to go ahead and say thank you for all the support on the last videos. You all have gotten, uh, we've gotten up to 20, not you all, uh, us as a community are up to 21 subscribers, which is freaking awesome. You all rock. Um, and yeah, that's, that's just pretty awesome. If you want to join the community, I'm more than well happy to have you here. We have a Discord server, we have a Twitter and such, and all that good stuff. So yeah, go ahead and, go ahead and subscribe if you feel like doing that and you're enjoying the series. On another note, I think I've decided what we're going to do today. Uh, we're going to be recording a little bit different today. I'm trying out some new things. I'm going to just sit here and record for a few hours and just make multiple episodes from it. I've done that once, and I think some of my best videos came from that. So that's what we're going to do. So yeah, the next couple of episodes are all going to be recorded at the same time as this one. We haven't added any more mods. Um, I'm mainly, mainly because the last two times I added mods, I had to do a heck load of troubleshooting, and I'm kind of crunched for time. But once this recording session is done, I'm going to do some more troubleshooting and, and install a whole bunch more mods. And uh, yeah, that should be good. But what we're going to do in this episode is we're going to continue our way along and make our way to the uh, to the Diamond City. I want to continue the main storyline. So that's what we're going to do. So yeah, I'll see you when we get to Diamond City. Hmm, do I want to help with these super mutants? You know what? Yeah, we'll help with the super mutants. Okay, there's one super mutant dead. Alright. Alright. Let's see, where's the next one? Oh, you're gonna die, Mr. Man. Pew. Oh, my next shot's gonna miss you. Okay. Let's switch to something a little less costly for me to shoot. Oh, you big green freak. Come on. Just die already? You or me? Alright, man. You dead? Damn. Not afraid oh, of mutants, wow. huh? You're our kind of gal. No, I'm not really afraid of mutants at the moment. Later on, that'll probably change. Nothing over... Okay, we got all those frag mines. I like myself some good frag mines. Let's go ahead and loot some corpses. There's a gun, guys. Oh, well, I didn't fall as far as I was hoping it would. Uh, did I look at you? No, I didn't, because I didn't take your bottle caps. I'd always take your bottle caps. All right, Diamond City. On the a dangerous place. How's it going? You, you can't open the gate. Door. Stop playing around, Danny. I'm standing out in the open here for crying out loud. I got orders not to let you in, Miss Piper. I'm you a sorry. troublemaker. I'm just doing my job. Ooh, just doing your job. Protecting Diamond City means keeping me out, is that it? <laughs> oh, look, it's the scary reporter. Boom. I'm sorry, but Mayor McDonough's really steamed, Piper. Saying that article you wrote was all lies. The whole city's in a tizzy. <sighs> you open this gate right now, Danny Sullivan. I live here. You can't just lock me out. Well, that's exactly what he did, isn't it? You want into Diamond City, right? Well, yeah. I just got here, but yeah. Shh. Play along. Okay, I can do that. I what, can play what's along. What's that? You said you're a trader up from Quincy? You have enough supplies to keep the general store stocked for a whole month? <laughs> you hear that, Danny? You gonna open the gate and let us in, or are you gonna be the one talking to Crazy Myrna about losing out on all the supply? Jeez, all right. No need to make it personal, Piper. Give me a minute. All right, we got Better the door to the, the Diamond the City opened.
You first? You first. Wouldn't have it any other way. Piper, who let you back inside? I told Sullivan to keep that gate shut. Well, you you're a dick for doing that. Rabble rousing slanderer. The level of dishonesty in that paper of yours. I'll have that printer scrapped for parts. Oh, will you now? Ooh, that a statement, Mr. McDonough? Tyrant mayor shuts down the press. Why don't we ask the newcomer? Hmm. You support the news? Because the mayor's threatened to throw free speech in the dumpster. This Always one. believed in freedom of the press. Oh, I didn't mean to bring you into this argument, miss. No, no, no. You look like Diamond City material. No, I don't. Welcome to the great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Fuck you and fuck Safe, your city. Happy. Get out of here, McDonough. Place to come. I want to shoot money. you. Settle down. Don't let this muckraker here tell you otherwise. All right. I'm more of a <laughs> good neighbor. I'm more of a good neighbor kind of gal. Well, my character is. Let's see. Uh, what do we do? I'm sure your city is a great place. <laughs> yeah, greatest house. Of but I'm gonna be non-confrontational. Until the wind blows. Because being confrontational <laughs> is not in my spirit. Now, was there anything particular you came to our city for? I'm just. Passing I'm just passing through. through. Oh, very well then. Oh, well, whatever you do, don't bother going to Diamond City Security for help. Uh, don't listen to her. Well. I'm afraid that our security team can't follow every case that comes through. I'm confident that you can find help here. Diamond City has every conceivable service known to man. One of our great citizens can surely find the time to help you. A hmm. mayor of a great city must know everyone. Who can help me? Oh, I'm sorry, I don't have time for All any right. more questions. I'm a busy man. Okay, Enjoy we'll get your the fuck stay out. in our fair city. <sighs> this is ridiculous. I want the truth, McDonough. What's the real reason security always shrivels away when talk of missing persons I've had enough up? of this, Piper. From now on, consider you and that little sister of yours on notice. Yeah, keep talking, McDonough. All right, That's then. all you're good for. Hmm, <laughs> a big Diamond City welcome from the mayor. Do you feel honored <laughs> yet? Look, I gotta go get settled in, but, um, stop by my office later. I have an idea for an article you'd be perfect for. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and make my way inside so I can sell a bunch of shit. Uh, if you all like it whenever I stop to like listen to what the uh, the whatchamacallits, listen to the dialogue and like I don't speak, is that something that's like, is that better or worse or should I talk through them? I don't know. I don't know. What do you all think? Anyone is one of those things. Okay. Everybody, everybody just keep talking. I'm going to go over to Arturo. Hey there. Hey, you're the new girl, right? Yes. Yeah, I'm the new girl. Well, it's good to have you here. Name's Arturo Rodriguez. If you need protection, let's talk. Sure. I'll take a look. Sure. Self-defense at its best. What do you have? You got Old Faithful, which uh, does double damage to the target. No, yeah, Old Faithful. Not to me, at least. What else you got? Oh, you got this pistol. That's a really expensive pistol. But you know what? We'll grab it. And at the end of the episode, uh, at the end of this episode of part eight, We'll we'll have a mod review of this pistol, but for now we're just gonna use it. We're gonna use it. We're gonna have a we're gonna have a grand old time. All right. Wait. Nope. One second. I can actually sell some stuff to you. I can sell you. What does this use? Oh Jesus! It uses forty-five ammo. Okay. Okay. I can I can deal. How about I sell you some drugs? Here. Have. Have some drugs. All right, that works. That works for me. All right. Well, I guess that does that for I hear a bit. A bar in the uh, let's go ahead and talk to. I don't know her name. The lady over like Nick that? Valentine's place. Hey, lady. Hey, lady. 
Yeah, they are lady. Told you your luck wouldn't last forever. Hey, lady. How's it going? Something wrong? Another stray coming in from Ellie the rain. Ellie Perkins. Hey, how's it going? Afraid you're too late. Office is closed. If you say so. I know you must be busy, but I won't take much of your time, miss. It's important. You don't get it. The detective, he's gone. Missing. Oh, no. Don't worry. Don't worry. I can help. Tell me what happened. <sighs> Nick was working a case. Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman, and he tracked them down to their hideout in Park Street Station. There's an old vault down there that they use as a oh. base. I told Nick he was walking into a trap, but he just smiled and walked out the door like he always does. Hmm. I'll find, I'll him. find him. You have my word. Thank you. Nick should be easy to spot. He's always wearing that old hat and trench coat getup. Please hurry. All right. I will. I will go ahead and do that thing you call hurrying. That's important. It sounds important at the very least. Hmm. 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 Don't Whoa. move, Simp. What have you done with the real Riley? Where's Hi, my Hi, Riley. I swear I'm not a Simp. Don't shoot, for God's sakes, we're family! Huh. Put the gun down, now! He's a Simp! He'll kill us all! Kyle, Oh, no! you killed him. Okay, well, I'm gonna show's take over. His sweet there ball. are no Simps in Diamond City. Hear me? Just you hey. folks in your damn paranoia. He pulled a gun on me. My own brother. Your brother's mm, dead. Yeah. He would have killed you. I'm I'm not a synth. I, I told him. I, I kept telling him. Why didn't he listen to me? I, uh... I need a minute. Take all the time you need, buddy. Hey. Officer? I need you to step away, Scabber. What happened? I understand, officer. I just want to know what happened. What, you didn't hear the shouting? Guy pulls a gun on his own brother, thinking he's a synth. Huh. It's that newspaper's fault. Got all people right, all then. riled up, thinking their own family might be replaced by machines. Look, I'm sorry you got caught up in all this, but it's over, okay? Just go about your business like nothing happened. Better that way. All right. For? Kyle, I'll do that then. Okay, Polly. You have a good one, Polly. I've read Polly and I was like, wait, that's not Polly, because I've been playing Fallout 76 recently. But no, Remember that's Grace definitely Polly. They're both Polly. There's multiple Anything Pollys. Uh, this is what I like about you, Wellingham. You know what you are. Hmm. I'm not trying to be anything other than helpful. Uh, not like those people down there. Lower field workers always want what they haven't earned. Oh, an astute observation, sir. Let me just freshen your glass again. Thank you, Wellingham. Hello. I may have been programmed to serve, but in your case, I shall do so disdainfully. Well, fuck you. Let me know when you're ready to order. Let's see sure. what you got. Let's take a look. <sighs> Very well. Hmm. You don't have anything I want. I just wasted your time. Hello, <clears> Malcolm. <throat> oh, I don't object to you outsiders coming up here, but must you insist on speaking to me? Okay then. Okay then. Um. What is wrong with this door? Why is the middle of the door not counted? My game is so fucked. Just random shit like that just doesn't work. Come on, Darcy. Let's go. Broken. Take it easy. I don't think she wants to leave just yet. Hey, this is between me and my wife. Why don't you mind your own damn business for once? Oh God, Paul. Why do you always have to make a scene? Pour me another drink, Henry. Damn it, Darcy, I just want you to come home. I'll be home later. I can't believe you'd do this to me, Cook. Do what to you, Paul? You smug bastard. You keep away from my wife, goddammit. You'd better get out of here before you do something stupid. You son of a bitch. Don't hurt him, Henry. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, round two. Round, you get on. up there and you beat his ass. No. I'll be at home, Darcy. No, you, no, no. I'm getting in your son. way. 
I'm getting in. No, 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 no. You go back there. You beat his ass. You do that. Stand up for yourself. Yeah, he got better on you in round one, but round two can be different. You understand? Do you understand? Turn around and... Okay, then. What's up? Okay, get out of here so I can talk to other people, you mopey fuck. Jesus. Sorry I had to see that. Things are usually a lot quieter around here. Perfect place to drink, if you're buying. What was that, what argument, was that about? argument about? Uh, nothing much. You see, Darcy here likes to relax and enjoy life from time to time, and her husband Paul doesn't. Okay. He's not a bad A little bit guy, rude to really. walk away. Just a little uptight. Too bad he can't learn to relax, huh, Darcy? Shut up. I don't come here to talk about Paul. You there. I haven't seen you in here before. That's because I haven't been here before. Useful and buy me a drink or something. You don't, you look, don't like look like you need, like you need drink. another drink. Aren't you all high and mighty then? Why don't you get lost so I can drink in peace? Lighten up, Darcy. This isn't your own private bar, no matter what you might think. Now, you need to order anything? So is this so your place? So is this your place? That's right. Owner, bartender, sympathetic ear. I try to provide a little oasis from the hardships of life. Name's Cook, by the way. Henry Cook. Let me know if I can get you anything. All right. Not today. Don't need anything today. Gotcha. Let's go ahead and see where... Wait, isn't... Is there a quest with this dude? I thought there was a quest up here. You know what? I'm not... I'm not even gonna bother. Let's go ahead and walk this way. Talk this way. Let's talk to Piper before Public we go to, to uh, go to Vault, your... whatever the fuck it's called. Vault 112 or something like that. 114, I think. Piper! I'm glad you dropped by. You holding up, Blue? Hmm. It's been it's a bad been day. It's been a bad day. Not like a cozy day in the vault, huh? Yeah, I know where you're from. You're not wearing the blue jumpsuit right now, but the Pip-Boy and that fish-out-of-water look? Dead giveaways. This is funny, because so I'm deal. not a vault dweller. I want an interview. This is one of the Your things I don't think that they could print. fix with the alternative time mod. Diamond City had a little the alternative start mod to the start me up. But, we're going to go ahead and do uh, this conversation what. anyway for I'll the free come XP. With you. Watch your back while you get used to the world above ground. I'm not a vault <laughs> dweller. Oh. I'm not a vault dweller. But, all right, Piper. I'm in. Oh, well, they did have a solution to it. Let's get down to business. So, you've seen the Commonwealth, Diamond City. How does it compare to your old life? Honestly, seeing every, uh... <laughs> this one. I've been having too much fun blowing things up to think about it. Gotta make my job hard for me, huh? All right, if that's the quote, that's the quote. For the last part of our interview, I'd like to do something different. Oh, they take out the point where she asks Diamond about City the vault. Directly. That's actually kind of clever. Kidnapping is all but ignored in the Commonwealth. Everyone wants to pretend it just doesn't happen. What would you say to someone out there who's lost a loved one but might be too scared or too numb to the world to look for them? <laughs> Let's do this one. Take it one day at a time. Just keep going. That's all anyone can do. Yeah, well, you gotta keep in, to, huh? keep on going one day at every time. To that. That's everything. It's going to take some time to put this all together, but I think your story is going to give Diamond City plenty to talk about. Anyway. All right. I agreed to come with you, right? Watch your back. Just say the word when you're ready. I can't wait to see where the story goes next. All right. Come Piper. on, Piper. Head my way. Sure. Let's go. Let's go. Will do. We're going down to Devault in Park Street Station. And you're gonna join me, and I hope that you're really good at eating bullets, because that's what you're gonna do. 
It's big, loud, full of corrupt officials and brown-nosing citizens, but it's home. If you say so. Let's see. I am almost unable to carry anything. What is so heavy? You know what? You come here. Come here. Hey. Hmm? Trade with sure. me. Sure. Take a peek. I want you to take... I don't want to give you grenades. That's for damn sure. <laughs> you know what? I'll give you that. And I'll give you that. It's probably worse than we have. You know what? You can have all that. That, that, that'll do. That'll do, pig. That'll do. All right. Uh, we need to eat and drink. So let's, let's do that. Purified water. Uh, and where's the nearest cooking station? I gotta cook something. Cook. Cooking station. Here we go. You want to make me a second printing press while you're at it? <clears throat> you read the paper. Damn sense. Get off Hiding the goddamn. The Fuck you. Get away. I need to use hey, this. How about I introduce you to my confidential informant? Oh, Takahashi. Thank you. Okay. All right, we have a lot of food now. No. Let's see. Where is G in the alphabet? Properly fit. Hey, you there? I am. Um, I have a question for you. Oh, you do? Go ahead. Go I'm ahead. listening. I'm listening. You were in the tap house before, when. You tried to punch out the bartender? What was you that all about? You tried to punch out the bartender. What was that all about? I thought it was dead obvious. Cook is sleeping with my wife. And I'm supposed to just pretend I don't know. Until Cook decides he's bored with her and she comes crawling back home to me. Hmm. Everybody's got their problems, pal. No, I need your help. I'll, I'll pay you. I've got some money and I can get some more. I'm going to go back and talk to him, and I want you to come with me. You saw? You won't take me seriously otherwise. I don't want to have to really hurt him. I just want him to leave Darcy alone. Okay, I'll okay. help you. I'll help you. Okay, good. Good. I'm sure Cook will back down once he sees you're with me. Let's go. Let's go. You do the talking, I'll be the intimidating presence. All right. Come on. Okay. We are apparently doing a detour. We're, we're going to join him in going this way. Hey, who wants to look beautiful? Hairstyles from across the country. Okay, one second. Or I'm not waiting for him to walk all the way over there. Let's go. Okay, lady. You're kind of a bitch. We get it. All right. Go on through. Oh, my Jesus. You Just remain quiet while you're up here. I will fucking shoot you. Down below. God damn. Blow your goddamn head off. Don't be late. Yeah, yeah, I'll be there. I just have to close up. We need to talk. Jesus, Paul. What now? It's time for you to shut up and listen, Cook. What the hell is this? And what are you doing here? Don't tell me he's hired you to help lean on me. What difference, what difference does, it does it make? I just like to know who to shoot at when the guns come out. My well, gun's already I'm out. Listening, Paul. What do you have to say this time? Just this. You leave Darcy alone starting now 
or else. Now that is a very bad idea. You don't want to pull a gun on me unless you intend to use it. But you think I won't use it? Huh? Do I just need to kill you? Is that what you're saying? Put the, Put gun the guns away, away before, before this, gets, this out gets out of hand. That's right. We can solve this like civilized people. Too late. Here we go. <laughs> Fuck. God damn it. I just realized something I haven't saved. I'll meet you there then. Don't be late. Yeah. Oh, wait. Yeah, Never I'll mind. We have there. that fixed now. I just have to close up. We need to talk. Jesus, Paul. What now? God, I love it's that time mod. for you to shut up and listen, Cook. What the hell is this? And what are you doing here? Don't tell me he's hired you to help lean on me. All right, let's just get it? this through. I, well, huh? just this. Now that. But you think I. Uh. Do this I'll one. Put the gun away. Nobody needs to get shot here. There's no way this works out in your favor if you pull that trigger. Hey, hold on. I'm sure we can work this out. Keep talking. Okay, good. Henry, you you want to make with the apologizing? Look, I, uh, I'll stay away from Darcy from now on. It's over. You have my word on that. Your word? What's your fucking word worth, huh? I'll make it up to you. I know a way to get a lot of money right now. You and I both know the only reason Darcy comes up here is she's pissed at you. If you were flush again, everything would be different. Besides, I owe you for what I've done. Well, what do you think? <laughs> we can always kill him later, if it doesn't work out. I'm going to choose to ignore that comment. Here's the deal. I have some other um, businesses on the side. Oh, One of them you're is making Nelson dirty Latimer money. Spend his dad's money to make himself feel like a gangster. I like the part about money. I like the part about the money. Holy shit, Cook! Does Malcolm know about this? What do you think? No, of course not. Anyway, that's between him and Nelson. So where was I? Oh yeah. Me and Nelson are supposed to be meeting some gentleman from Good Neighbor to exchange Nelson's cash for their chems. My plan is simple. We take the money and the chems. Hmm. I mean, let's I'm do in. this. Let's do this. What do you say, Paul? Are we good? Good? Hardly. But I don't mind you helping me get rich. Okay, I guess we're doing this quest. On a way out. Hmm, I I don't I don't quite remember how this quest goes, but I know you have to like You do have to kill a certain certain people. You have to kill some people. So it should be a good test for this little this little pistol we just picked up. Do we just have to meet them there? Is that all we have to do? I believe that's all we have to do. And then I think there's another part of this quest that takes you to, like, the other side of Diamonds... Or not Diamonds, of, uh, of Boston, but... I'm not gonna bother with going all the way to the other side of Boston. Because that would take forever. Let's go ahead and run our way over there. Keep moving, Scatter. Shut the hell up, Diamond City, city Security God. Alright, I'll see you all when we get over there. Nelson's starting to think he doesn't need me. I'm sure Trish won't hand over the chems until I get there. You see, I'm the one she trusts. Gotcha. Gotcha. So being late doesn't matter as long as you're the one that people trust.
He's gonna run up this way. All right, everybody, we're here. We're here. We're here gonna we be are. doing a quest. The meat is just ahead. Well, there's always four of Morowski's goons. Trish, who's in charge, and then three other guys to unload the boat and wave their guns around. All right. You should right. be able to work your way around these buildings to get a good angle on them. I'll wait for the shooting to start, then join in from here. Remember, we can't afford to let anybody get away. Sounds good? Sounds good. I wonder how much AP taking a shot from this thing mate requires. I'm sure it does I'm sure it's not a, a small amount. Where the All right, we just have to hope all of these hit. Oh Jesus, I'm dead. Oh, God damn it. You know what? I have a better idea for how to approach that. All right. Everybody seems to have been, uh, free for the taking. Quite well killed by that plan that was a good plan i enjoyed that plan what's up don't move uh, you don't have to kill me i won't talk i swear you do now Give me a reason Give not to kill you. Give me a reason you. not to kill you. I don't need a better reason than to shut her up. I'll tell Morosky it was gunners, okay? You can trust me. And uh, uh, I'll give up Morosky's chem lab. This here, <laughs> this is nothing compared to what he's got stashed there. Sorry, no witnesses. Sorry, no witnesses. It's over. So that's that. I told you it was no problem. Hmm. The money should still be on Nelson's body. And then there's these chems, which you'll need to sell somehow. But that's your problem now. I'm leaving town. All right. Good. Whoa, he did have like a thousand caps. make things easier for Paul to have me gone. Plus, there's no plausible way I could explain to Morowski how I wasn't involved in this unless I die here along with everyone else. Yeah. You won't be able to blame me for all your problems anymore. All right then. You're leaving You're already, leaving already? But, but I was having so much fun together. But we were having so much fun together. I think I'm getting <laughs> too old for your kind of fun. So, it's just the two of us. 50/50 seems fair to me. 70/30 seems 70 more 30 like 70/30 seems more like it. The man's not your welcome mat. No, not this time. 50-50 is fair, and that's what we're doing. You take the money from Nelson, and I'll take the chems. Aren't, Aren't the chems, chems worth more, more than, than the, the money? money? Sure. If you owned a chems shop right here, but I'll have to pay the mayor his cut, plus move all this back to town. Hey, what you got for me? All right, then. What's new, Cook? Good to see you. All right, well, that's that, I guess. That's a quest done. We got some f drugs for a man who has wife issues. And oh, well, let's go this way. Now we're gonna go to Park Street Station. Wait, is that quest not over? 
Read Trisha's note, really? I have to read your stupid note. Where's your note? Trisha's note. All right. Well, I guess I guess that's that's that. I'm. Nope. I'm not searching for the recon team. I'm not doing anything. I'm doing this. This is what we're doing. We're gonna go find Nick Valentine. We should have stopped at a doctor in Diamond City, but that's just not gonna happen now because I'm not going back to Diamond City. I'm gonna go do this. Today's mod review is going to be the Sig Sauer P220 by Millennia, Doombased, and Sam61. This mod it adds a pistol, the Sig Sauer P220 of course, and it is a very very nice mod. It has nice textures, nice meshes, really nice animations, I actually really like the animations on this gun, and it has great audio. The, the gun feels like it has weight, it sounds good, it looks good, the animations for reload in both first and third person look fine there's no issues and I really enjoy that there's a lot of chance for uh, a lot of chance there's a lot of ways to customize the weapon it has a lot of attachments I didn't unfortunately get uh, footage of the workbench uh, stuff and I'm kind of running short on time so I'm not able to show that to you but I'm just gonna go ahead and list off a bunch of attachments you can get there's silencers compensators I believe there's a bayonet there's a laser there's multiple different sites for the weapon and there's different receivers it can it starts off firing 0.45 rounds and it can go to 0.38 rounds as well it has no mod conflicts from what i can see see it's sold at vendors i think it's also in the level list leveled list so i haven't had any issues as far as mod conflicts uh with this weapon and it is in general just a really high quality mod i really enjoy it and i would give it a 9 out of 10. I would like to thank each and every one of you all for joining me in this episode. If you enjoyed the content, please go ahead and drop a subscription. If you want to find out more about me, I have a Discord server. You can ask me any question in my Discord server. I have a Twitter and I have a Patreon if you want to support me that way. Have a wonderful day. Everything's linked in the description. And stay awesome. Oh, also, don't shoot people like on the daily. That's like at most a weekly thing.